because we're now just chatting. Uh, and that is my cue to switch into this mode here. Lane, you still with me? Because it's about time to try a beer. Now I'm going to give you a choice between three distinct beers. They're the last three that I've got from Clown, Shrew, Clown Shoes Brewery. I have Bubble Farm IPA. I have Clown Shoes Hoppy Feet Black IPA. So, oh boy, that's some great inflection on those reads. Let's try that again. Bubble Farm IPA, Hoppy Feet Black IPA, or Galactica Double IPA. And the choice is yours. And yours alone. Hoppy Feet Black IPA it is. I think we close. I think I'm gonna close out clown shoes with their Galactica. That's my my plan. We'll go with the hoppy feet here, though. Uh, I'm gonna bring the lights up as well because it's just a little. This is a bit much. So. Whoop. All right. First of all, the can art. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun, dun. That looks to me personally like Tom Hanks sitting at a desk. Uh, with his feet up, wearing clown shoes. I don't know if it's supposed to be Tom Hanks. That's just how I feel about it. So, um, that's my theory, anyway. And let's crack it open and have a sniff. Well, it smells like an IPA, but also it smells... Like, it might have some coffee notes or some some chocolate hops in there or something. This is going to be a weird one, I think. I think this is going to be real weird. Oh, yeah. No, that tastes a lot more like a stout than it does an IPA. Um, what's different about it from being a stout is that it doesn't have that thick um, rolling mouth feel. It doesn't have the, like, the crazy uh, fizz or the... It's, um, it's, it's much crisper and um, thinner. Uh, it, it feels more like watery uh, on, the, on the mouth. And it has a sort of a crisp... Um, dry hoppiness to it at the same time as having the the um coffee flavors that you would expect from from a porter uh or or something like that uh hello i'm also uh seem to pop in just in time for the beer yes you did hey laura how you doing um this is frankly fascinating i uh, it, it really is um because it's it's they've taken two beers and, and made them into one and it's not like there's two beers fighting against each other in here they have blended the best elements from the two it's it's light and crisp and refreshing um uh at the same time as being dark and roasty and toasty and i i i've no idea how they've managed that but that's like, this is actually one of the quickest, easiest, most concise reviews that I've ever done of a beer. Because it, it, it is, um, it's, bam, that's what it is. You don't have to think about it. You don't have to mull over the details. It's simple. It's straightforward. It's to the point. And it gets the job done. It's hoppy feet. Oh, that's backwards. Or, no, it's not. All right, good. It's hoppy feet by Clown Shoes. That's what's going on. It was good, too. It's really good. 